Hi, this is Paulo Trincol with PLX Devices here at the 2013 SEMA show. I'd like to demonstrate to you our Kiwi uh, product line. And basically what Kiwi is, is a car to smartphone connection. So basically OBD2 interface to any smartphone or tablet connection. Really simple to use. Uh, the Kiwi comes with a wireless uh, dongle and the OBD2 connector. Now our new Kiwi 2 has advanced sleep mode as well as a aftermarket sensor interface back here. I'll talk about that later. Really simply use plug this into your vehicle. It takes about 10 seconds to do. Uh, turn it on. Pair the device either through Bluetooth or Wi-Fi. The Bluetooth interface is used for Android uh, applications and the Wi-Fi one is for Apple or iOS type of application. So depending on the type of device you have, uh, you can either go with a Bluetooth interface or a Wi-Fi interface. Basically, once you've done that, you can pretty much turn it on and it pairs with a phone or a tablet and you can get all of your OBD2 data uh, on a tablet. So here we're looking at RPM, speed, acceleration, power, torque. You can also get fuel economy, MPG, uh, miles, um, lots of parameters about fuel consumption, engine check data, air intake temperature, map, pressure, mass, airflow sensor, timing. Um, so pretty much everything that your car ECU is outputting at any given time. You can read that on your smartphone or tablet and show that, uh, show that information for you to use and diagnose the vehicle. The other nice thing about the Kiwi 2 is that you can, you're not limited to the sensors that you have in your car at any given time. We have what we call a serial IMFD adapter. And that adapter basically just goes on the back of the Kiwi 2. So it makes it a little bit thicker, but it basically just attaches to the back of the Kiwi 2. And that allows you to daisy chain up to an additional 16 sensor modules, um, which allow you to get wideband air fuel ratio, exhaust gas temperatures, fuel pressures, you name it. So whatever your car doesn't have, you can use our Kiwi 2 with the aftermarket interface uh, for your aftermarket sensors. 